Hey, what's going on? It's Rogan Josh. I'm a bass player from Adelaide in South Australia. And today, a new Thousand Below song has just dropped. Longtime fan of these guys. Super keen to hear this. This one's called Gone To Me. Let's go. All right, let's do it. Push me, tell me I'm breathing. Checking for pulses is your favorite distraction. Keep me left out, feeling exhausted. I feel like I'm haunted by the love that I used to hold. And I choked you, bro. Different vibe. A little bit of auto tune back there as well. Will it explode? Alright, uh, I think their last one had a bit more of a pop punky tone to it as well, so uh, I forgot about that. But this, yeah, real upbeat, sad vocals, but upbeat song. Crunchy bass tone. Getting weird vibes from this, like this is like some 2010 synth core stuff in the background, but then it's kind of poppy. I don't, I don't know. It's a lot of fun. All right, there's two shots that I want to talk about. I want to talk about this shot here. Like, is this green screen? Is this a photo? And then they've got him on a green screen and they've somehow figured out how to put it over the window. Because this is a weird shot. And the other one is this one here. This is a weird shot as well. Like, is this green screen? Because it's a bit too blurry in the background. Like, is this a pandemic video? Like when they're stuck at home and they've tried to put together a, a video? Because I, I feel like these two shots don't fit. I love the... Uh, I love this plain background and I love the outside shots, but then those other two are just very strange. Love the outside shots. Covid beard going, inside grown. It's a photo. This shot and that last shot are photos and they're not very good and they, they bug me. Especially when the rest of the video looks so good. All right, that was Gone To Me by Thousand Below. These guys have changed a lot. Uh, so their progression has been more to an upbeat kind of feel. They were more kind of like post-hardcore metalcore-ish. 
when they first came out their first album uh was real refreshing i loved it uh just really solid good kind of post hardcore music and um yeah these these two songs of theirs that i've done a reaction to are just a little too upbeat feel good uh for the kind of stuff that i would normally listen to this is kind of good stuff maybe to put on around the house like when the whole family's home so i might put this on my emo songs you can play around your kids playlist but um yeah for, for what they were to what they're kind of changing to with the last two singles i'm just not into it as much they're fine if you love this then don't listen to me because it is good i'm just talking for my personal taste i'd kind of like stuff with more of a more of a heavy edge to it uh, than this but I know, I guess I'm kind of sad because their first album was like real breakout, really big, really cool, and I, I thought that it was like something really special. So kind of them changing into something that's a little more standard is a little upsetting. Um, and I, I am putting it down to, I am going to choose to believe that this is because of the current world condition, that this is something that... This reeks of a song that was written separately at home, uh, just because it was a little too standard with the drums and, and everything, and a lot of After Effects going in on the vocals and stuff, and the video does as well. Mo like, 80% of the video, very cool, clean, high quality, these outside shots, amazing. Then it went to those two bizarre, weird shots that just really throw off the whole vibe of the video. I, I didn't get that. Thousand Below, still a very good band. Uh, if you haven't heard them, go back and listen to their first album. It is something else. It's like really, really cool, really solid. One you can throw on anytime. Listen the whole way through, you'll love it. Yeah, I'm not 100% not down with uh, the direction that they're moving into but that's just me and that's just me on first listen something that happens often is i'll have my first reaction like this then i'll chuck it in a playlist then i'll hear it a few times and it'll turn into my like my favorite song i listen to forget me too i'm sitting here saying this is a bit too poppy i'm listening to mgk and youngblood stuff often <laughs> so so we'll see anyway uh, if you did like this reaction, you can hit like down below. If you want to see my reactions as they come out, you can subscribe to the channel. I'm a Twitch streamer every Tuesday night. My podcast, the Alt Music Podcast, can be found on all podcast services. And all my social media stuff is down below. Thank you guys so much. I'll see you next time. All right, see ya.